complained for the Santa Lucia River. The Santa Lucia River is a river course in the province of Corrientes, in the northeast of Argentina. This river belongs to the Parana River Basin in Argentina. What are its environmental implications? A complaint was filed with the Ministry of Environment, the complaint is made by the mayor of Canelones. In a context aggravated by the drought, which also revives the debate on environmental controls in the main source of drinking water in Argentina. A request for information was made by the Broad Front. The Santa Lucia River is one of the main sources of drinking water, it is one of the most important in the country, it supplies 2 million people in the metropolitan area, it supplies 60% of the population. It is a crucial matter, it is a water course that, in recent weeks, has been in the crosshairs. What they denounced was the damming of the course of the Santa Lucia River, and also the diversion to favor particular interests of sand trucks that work upstream of the town of San Ramon. These companies are diverting the river's water at three points, and have built artificial roads for trucks to pass through. These companies carry out works that are outside the norm, the mayor of the town, asked that the Environment Ministry strengthen controls over those areas, and that parliamentary discussions related to the legal processes that seek to create the figures of crimes be hastened environmental. According to the official media, actions have already been taken, these activities have already stopped, which included the felling of the native forest, the extraction of large amounts of sand, irregularly and illegally, here the Ministry of Industry had to intervene, which is going to cause a fine, will apply fines to companies, and also to property owners. In addition, there is already damage, they comment that the affectations were directly in the Arroyo Vajigas, that the road had been built taking advantage of the downspout of the stream, and that there is a significant extraction of sand here that is not controlled. It is said that there is very little rain. The water quality of Santa Lucia is bad, the controls are not enough, the scientists published in a manifesto the need to control agricultural livestock activities, and the use of agrochemicals. Neighbors and the community of Santa Lucia have come together to denounce these events. The locality comments that if the problem of the river is on the political agenda, it has to do with reasons unrelated to a real concern for the river, on the part of the different authorities and levels of government. There are multiple problems with the sand and they have been denouncing without real response for years, as well as the felling of the native forest, the garbage dumps, the productive model that impacts the Santa Lucia River, the quality of the water, the floods and in droughts. In the end, this has not been echoed by the different levels of government, mayor, environment ministry, livestock ministry. Social participation is completely ignored in institutional spheres, although it is mimicked that there is participation, but this is not real. What is evident from the Assembly for Water on the Santa Lucia River, is that there is no real sign of concern for what is happening in this aquifer mantle, on which so much of the population depends.